Thank you, Mr. Chairman. I want to thank you for calling this important hearing and refocusing all of us on the consequences of our massive and growing federal debt. Like you, I reject the premise that concern about the debt is fading. As I travel uh, my district in central and eastern Kentucky, people consistently tell me that restoring fiscal responsibility is their top priority. And the reason is simple. People in my district are smart. They know that it's a problem that the federal government spends significantly more than it takes in. They know that Washington's spending problem only gets worse the longer we delay honestly confronting it. And they know that future generations will have to work longer and harder in order to receive less as they shoulder the burden of debt that our federal government is now creating. In addition to reforming unsustainable mandatory spending programs which are crowding out critical investments in education, medical research, transportation, and national security, our focus needs to be on durable long-term economic growth and job creation. And we cannot create that job creation and growth if we are in a debt crisis that automatically imposes austerity on the American people. I yield back the balance of my time. Time of the gentleman.